the late game is just too hard. Once they have enough destroyers to just uh, reduce your Beastmaster to nothing. Even if you have like a, a huge economic advantage, it can be hard. But I think something like Beastmaster Demon Hunter second. Like I've always done it kind of solo or, or Beastmaster Naga. But I think with maybe a Demon Hunter second it could be a lot better. Insufficient gold. I'm just like, once you get used to having mana burn against undead, it's so hard to go back to anything else. It's so obnoxious to have a full mana death knight throw coils on your wisps. You can't do anything about it. I don't like it. I've become addicted to my mana burn. Can I ask a stupid question? I'm not sure if that's a real question or not, but it's all based on how much hit points the uh, unit has. So, if you get it low enough, you can steal it. Go oh, keeper the grove here. Oh, maybe the bear has too much max HP that it somehow somehow doesn't work. But I'm pretty sure it's all about how much HP is left. So if you get it like very very low, you should be able to steal it. But at that point, you might not want to steal it. If Toxie's here, I'm sure he has the correct answer. Definitely want to catch this guy. I'm gonna go uh, secure my own level three and then harass with more mana. Creeping pretty well here, he's probably secured his level 3, if he didn't have it already. Oh, he's teching. That's not good. I need to find him now. Where can he be? There he can be. So every entangle here is basically a kill. Don't need my archers to be around. 
Our warriors have engaged the enemy. Keeper alone can do this job. Oh wow! That was a fast tech. Oh boy, <clears throat> definitely need some uh, moon walls. Our sacred grove is being desecrated. was kind of bad though. Letting him get the uh, snipe that moon wool was pretty big. Check if I can. Is there danger? Oh. Tier 2 expansion. Interesting. Let's just right click the town hall here. Seems very greedy to do this against the keeper. down here. Let's see if we can get some rifle kills. Okay, he's up here stealing my shop. Okay, I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> Did he run straight up to mine? I think it's worth to just go hunt for him. Does not have uh, upgrades on his priest. Damn, heal. Heal is out healing my uh, entangle. I don't like it. Got this spell now. Our 
warriors have engaged the enemy. Alright, I got my orb now though, so. Oh, I need a wellspring. You can't kill giants with rifles. No way, buddy. No way. Get that S tier scout out. Another orb. Trust in my command. Let me throw one. I am vigilant. Command me. Is there danger for Kalindor? I grow anxious. Threaten the wild. So shall it be. Alright, I'm just gonna go creep now. Nature is restless. As long as he doesn't have an expansion. Pretty good. We can't build command me. Oh, he is tier 3. Nice. That's well pulled if I am not sticking to tier 2. So we'll set up for a backstab here. Gonna pick up a TP though, just to be safe. Banking. Is there danger? Trust in my command. Oh, we didn't get the item, that's very good for us. Get some more moon walls. Moon bracers, uh, I'm gonna sell that. He might be going for the red spot. So now we have triple staff, triple orb. Turn off the cold arrows. We are 
are poised to strike. Who threatens the wild? Nature is restless. Nice. Triple orb should creep this pretty fast. Not gonna get the item though. I need a moonstone here. Sell this. Keep getting upgrades. New TP, I think, is okay. No expansion. Goldmine's running low, I kinda wanna get nature's blessing. Make sure we can move our tree. What was the red item? I don't know. Let's find out. Looks like... He's not letting me check. Let's check with an owl what it was. Claws plus 12. That would have been really nice for my naga. Oh, he actually has quite a bit now. I think it's time to break. Gonna go pure chims. Gonna hide them in my main.
Oh. Damn, we lost the Naga. How do we deal with that? I mean, I think we still win without the Naga. We have 3-3. Three, three. Double Chim. Still a lot of Giants alive. And it's night time. But maybe I should sell... Sell the TP. I think we sell the TP. How much does he have? Not... Ooh, I have a bit. He has a bit. And I can't staff to the moon walls, which kind of actually sucks here. So I'm going to have to go for some serious hero focus action here. Just pure hero focus. I actually want to get into the gold mine so I can start getting some resources. Where's my Naga? There she is. Ah, triple orb again. Feels good. Get the old pout in there. I think uh, it got a little bit scary by the end there because I'm pretty sure he was like that was his max he was like 73 when he was attacking here and I was still banking so I banked a bit too long a bit too greedy but it worked out but definitely should have broke a little early. I, I wanted to wait for 3-3 three, three and, and Nature's Blessing, but I should not have gotten Nature's Blessing that early. Like, there's no really need for it. Should have just broke with Chimps. Knights don't count your MGs? I think they do. 
I think knights with inner fire is pretty much the best thing you can do. His army was actually really good this game. Like the Naga second wasn't at all bad because my Chim switch wasn't that scary. He could focus fire Chims with Cold Arrow, Hero, and Water Elementals and the whatever rifles he had left. They actually went down pretty fast, didn't do too much. Meanwhile, the inner fire knights are doing a lot of damage to my giants. Uh, I think definitely if you're playing a rifle tech and you see your opponents doing this, going tier 3 and then either adding warts or going knights, I think it's the best choice. The nice thing about going mords is that you already have the workshops so you can switch to gyros if you see chims. He had copies? Ah, maybe he had some illusions, that's true. I didn't even notice. Yeah, Bambi, I was also expecting something, because last game he rage quit, but I guess he was impressed with my intense orb micro. The early game here was actually really bad for me. I, I, I saw his movement here, and I thought for sure he was going to expand. So I was just like, okay, I'll creep this and run down and do, my, do some damage, but then he wasn't even here. So I wasted a whole lot of time doing nothing while he was running around creeping. And then he was all the way up here with level 3 before I even found him. So it was a very, very bad early game. I shouldn't... <clears throat> I should have scouted. It just really looked like he was going for that expansion. By the, the way he was moving. When I detonated my wisp, he was moving this way. I'm like, okay, here come the militia, he's going to get this. But he just went here. And then he must have gone... I guess he did this with Militia and did this. Maybe that's level 3? I'm not sure. 